Hey everybody, we're back again with another short video. Um, I just wanted to show you real quick how to kind of get a prettier looking prompt on your ZSH uh, shell. Um, nothing fancy by any means. You can go and go through all the trouble of downloading uh, oh my ZSH and installing it and along with it all the other stuff that you really don't need to do this. Um, so basically I'm going to show you real quick how to do it and uh, hopefully it helps you out. So let's take a look at what's needed. So I've got the uh, Brave browser opened here and I've gone to the Oh My ZSH page. Um, I've also gone into their GitHub so it gives me an idea of the different themes you can do, uh, the different plugins they have. Um, you know, so we can go on down and we can take a look at what all we've got here. So let's go and choose a theme real quick. So how about we go with, well let's just go with this, Bureau. So now we see this theme Bureau. Uh, we go into their themes file on the ZSH, oh my ZSH GitHub and we are looking for Bureau which is right here. So let's open up Bureau and we have fairly lengthy file but not nothing horrible so what we're gonna do is we're gonna open the raw and we are gonna copy it copy all of it we are gonna copy that now we are gonna go back and we're gonna open our file manager here and what I have is if you go under dot config in your home directory so it's gonna be home dot config create a .zsh file or directory excuse me once you've created the .zsh directory you need to go in there and we're gonna create a new file so so we're going to edit if I could type and what was that that was bureau b u r e a u dot z s h dot or dash theme so we're creating this new file and we're gonna just paste. That's all we're doing. We just copied it and now we're pasting it. And let's make sure we've got all of it. So new theme, so then let's go back up to the top of this. No, so it left out. So you gotta make sure sometimes when you're copying and pasting. So this just cut off right there, new theme, so. If we go. That's weird. So if we go up here, we need to have oh my ZSH bureau theme. Actually, we just need to comment that out because, well, it's not even part of the file. You can see it's commented out here, so it's just a comment saying that this is the oh my ZSH bureau theme. Let's make sure everything else looks good. Um, okay, so everything else seems to look good. Look okay. So we write and quit. So now we have right here bureau.zsh-theme. So what we're going to do now is we go into our .zshrc, which is going to be in our home folder. Find your .zshrc. We're going to open that, and I have it written up, broken down here under theme. But what we're going to do is we're just going to say source, and then put the path to that. So .config dot z s h and then u u r e a u dot z s h slash theme so it's at home dot config dot z s h bureau z s h theme so what we're going to do is then we're going to comment out our current theme we are going to write and quit we need to close out our terminal and then when we open again we now have the bureau theme installed it's just that simple. So instead of downloading all the stuff that comes along with Oh My ZSH that you don't really need, you can just pick and choose each little thing you want, download that into your, uh, or copy that into your .zsh file, and then source it from your .zshrc. And it works exactly the same as using Oh My ZSH. Um, but this way you only get what you choose to put in there and nothing else. So I appreciate you taking the time to watch. Um, I hope this helps you out and I hope you get a 
uh, get a little bit of use out of it. Um, I just want to thank you for watching, and I would appreciate any help you can get me in helping this channel grow. Um, I'm a little new to it, if you can't tell. My videos might be a little sloppy, but I'm working on it, and I'm hoping things will pick up, and uh, I can help you out, because, man, I'm thoroughly enjoying my, my journey into uh, Linux and open source world, I'm away from the proprietary headache that is Mac and Windows, and, you know, it's, it's just been a blessing to get into this, and... The community is awesome. I get to deal with great people on a on a daily basis going through this. Um, so any any likes and subscribes, notifications, anything uh, that I could get, comments, I would appreciate it. Um, anything to help me grow, help me make better videos for for me and for you. Because this, I'm learning as much doing this as I am hopefully trying to teach. Um, so it is what it is. Um, hopefully uh, you enjoyed it. So have a blessed evening, everybody. Thanks a lot.